All right, guys, and welcome back to Banishers Ghost of New Eden. As you saw in the last episode, we've reached kind of end game if we go through the void on the, the island, Cyridean's Island. So we are not doing that. We'll be taking on as many of the side quests as I can fit in before we head to I a point of no return. Has work for us. Daniel Keane. You did it, didn't you, you mutton-faced old hag? You downed well up and did it. Oh! Good day to you, Mr. Keen. Likewise, sir. What brings you this way? Well, maybe I can help you. I don't know. Everything okay? I'd like to ask both, but perhaps we can help. It might be more a case of what I can do for you. Oh, I Can you pull a plough? Interesting. But not what I meant. The thing is, Mr. Keane, you're haunted. Me? Who'd want to haunt me? Daniel, where's your sister? Edith. <laughs> Funny. Now you mention her, I haven't seen her much of late. In fact, I haven't seen her at all. You can't think she's dead. She can't be. She just can't be. If his sister is missing, why didn't he mention it? Well, actually, let's just go back a step. How do you know he's haunted anyway? I mean, I know you're a banisher, but is it just a sense you have? Is it like a, a sixth sense? But, but, yeah, okay, I mean, you just walk straight up to a guy, you're haunted. How long has she been missing? And why is there a shovel? Look at the, in the background, look, there's a shovel. <laughs> there's a shovel with a blue glowy thing. He's buried his sister alive in the back of the garden. How long has she been missing, sir? How long has your sister been missing? I don't know. Longer than she should. I hate them woods, I do. They're strange. Voices echo in the trees. Puts the woolies right up me. Oh, please, sir, my sister may be in danger. Can you find her? Uh, he wouldn't last an hour, would say, Antea. It's not very nice, Antea. She's getting a little bit... I don't know. Disagreeable. There better be something in it for us. Okay, what's she's just everything she's saying at the moment seems negative. He wouldn't last an hour, that's probably true. We know what lurks in the woods. He wouldn't last an hour out there. I can make no promises, Mr. Keane. Well, I am sympathetic to your predicament. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Alright, I think we're done. Goodbye for now, Daniel. Hurry. Find my sister, please. Sense the ripple of a past conversation. Oh, I sense it too. I sensed it in the middle of that conversation. Your crop is meager, but it's growing. Pray it stays that way. For what little brain we have is rotten. Now here we go. The mysterious shovel. Look, a chest. Well, open it, Jobanol. Jobanol. What? Is it a map? Could it be a treasure map? Let me see. Give it here. Oh. So, a treasure map. Edith left alone, or Daniel knew? Did Edith go treasure hunting alone? Ah, okay, all right. We'll ask him about that in a second, just before... Well, after, sorry. I'll pick up whatever this is. These tools have seen some service. The Keens aren't lazy. Hmm. Interesting. So, did he know? Did he not know? He seemed quite genuine, to be honest. So I see. Can't eat that. I'm at my wit's end with it. That decay is consistent with a haunting. Right. All right, sir. We found... Talk of a treasure map. What news of my sister? Did you find a treasure map? <laughs> well, we know you did. You found a map, I believe. Map? 
What map? A map. In a chest. You dug it up. With your sister. That map. Oh, yes. <laughs> that map. How do you know about that? I'm a banisher. I dig up secrets. Part of the job. I'm impressed. And, I admit, a little bit vexed. Where did the map lead? I don't know. Up into the hills, out into the woods, across the bridge on the Boston Road. I can't say where exactly. Hmm. Goodbye for now, Daniel. I ain't going nowhere. I'm not sure what to make of this guy. Like... You'd think he would have remembered a treasure map, but then only when we described it in great detail and kind of insisted. The bridge on the Boston Road. There'll be a waterfall somewhere not far away. Yeah, only after we insisted did he do anything about that, or did he comment any further? I don't know. Right, is that this one? Small fortunes. Yes, it is. Okay, we're going, thankfully, going to a place we've not ever visited hidden in the muck and the and the fog all right let me uh head to the nearest shelter and i will travel back i will travel over there and rejoin you in a second all right i've been running around like a bit of a lunatic i started off going all the way over to the waterfall on this side right over here thinking oh i could just take this road uh, God knows where that road is because I the game ended up taking me and directing me all the way back down here and then up across the bridge to Boston which was which was right about here and now I think finally get to the part of the map we've we need to be at unexplored what have we got I think you could take on a ghost I think you can take on a ghost Are you talking to me that first. Always the biggest problem. Troubles about. Oh, we've got another one. Okay. The snipers are down. And the slasher is still very much alive. Oh, that was a waste of a bullet. Mind you, thankfully, as I as, as commented before, the game's pretty kind on bullets infinite supply I don't know where he picks them up from alright Antair it's your turn where'd you go fella oh great what is it that every time we think we're getting somewhere they turn into another blob of something Incredibly weak to bullet headshots, these blobs. Oh, oh, now. now we've got that perk, which means Antea goes kung fu kicking every time we get a weak spot shot. There, uh, those fights are over a little bit quicker than usual. What? What? Oh God! Were you there that whole time? Oh, you were. Right, more map over there, but this map over here. Wow. I guess we'll certainly be crossing that rather carefully and delicately placed log in a moment. What do we have? Oh, one of these bridges. A bridge we cannot cross. I take the heart, you take the roots. Yeah, gotcha. Now we just got to figure out where the roots are before we even start shooting. Oh, there's something down there. Hold on a minute. Let's break that before. There we go. We've got one, two, and a third. Oh, I see. Give this a go. Okay, come on. 
Come on. No, 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 no. Wrong, wrong character. Oh, that's so frustrating. This might be easier. Farewell, weed. And there it is. Okay, that was a lot simpler. We have here some kind of temporary shelter. Every single blooming time you think you're getting somewhere. Once more with feeling. Once more with feeling. What are you talking about? You're in its sight, friend. Look, I do you think I don't know? All right, all right. Just want to get rid of that one first. I think we killed the uh, the shooter. Because this is what remains of him. For help if you need it. Really. Really, the one thing I would say about this game that really does need fixing is that her remonstrating with Red and shouting, ask for help if you need it. And she's the one in active combat. It's getting on my nerves. Love the game. Love the game. But they really do need to sort that out. Right. Oh, my God. Love this kung fu kicking. She's kicking the dogs all over the shop. I think I used to coat my wolf balls on one hand. I know. I, was, I knew I was about to get bitten by one of them on the side there. All right, all right. Let's just let's just take a step back. Ready and waiting. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. I'll tell you what. Let's let's do it then. You're ready and waiting. I don't like to leave you waiting. There you go. Satisfied? Oh, good lord. What? What's those symbols for? What are you doing? What? Are they... They came back to haunt the dogs that I'd already killed. Is that what that was? Get back up! Okay, okay. All right, we're doing good. They never Getting learn, far they? more dynamic. Oh, we still got something to find. What is this? This is a pretty hot area. Not found anything quite this busy for a while. Now, if her sister, his sister was on her way up here in search of treasure, how the hell did she get the through bridge that? The down. She can't have crossed. There. A path leads downwards. Oh, boy. I think that was the... Is that... Is that what I saw from the other side? I think it is. Leads down. Well, we're not getting across here in a hurry. Okay, it's one of those missions. Oh, God. Poor dog trapped. Very embarrassing. That spectre's for a body. Hey. 
I don't know. I think we rescued that situation a little bit. Good lord, this is ridiculous. Whoa, what? What happened there? Oh, for God's sake. Let's go. Think you could take on a ghost? Well, that's exactly what he thinks he can do. Watch out. Spectre possession. Reinforcements. All right. Used up an awful lot of energy I there. The <clears throat> <feeling> <clears throat> Don't the the death toll. God, it's just all over the screen. Right, time to back off. I think we just cleared out pretty much everyone. Yeah, recent signs of passage. Okay, that worked out pretty well. We've got a few notes over there, but a whole load of activity. There's a, a blue chest up there as well. How do we get up there? Can't see anything to shoot. Oh, hold on. Huh? Hmm. That definitely looks like it should be shot down. There's nowhere to shoot it. Hmm. Maybe from the other side. <laughs> A few notes, but oh, here we go. Public announcement Hear ye, access to the cave is now forbidden. Passage to the heart of the mountain is now inaccessible, and wolf traps have been set. Ah, that's what we saw in the mountain. Cross at your own risk. Edward's letter. Tom, we write this letter in desperation. The wolves are ever present and become bolder. The camp is threatened. Many wish to leave. Send hunters or soldiers or whoever will kill the blasted animals for we cannot. Then shall we resume work at full capacity. Yours, Edward. this somewhere to climb up to or some way to climb up Ooh. what 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 ah yes we saw that when we entered the area <laughs> I got you this is exactly the other side of that blue chest which I can't get through to oh but I could now all right I'll be back to get you Edward, here is the cargo you ordered. This year the fish are scarce. 
I don't know why. I've not the twenty, but a good fifteen. Go to the hut for payment. Take the account. Perhaps I will have caught those missing by then. Six pint, six trout, and four catfish. Love that. A good fifteen. Trying to put a positive spin on it. It's like when people say, have you got a quick minute? Or let's have a... <laughs> a quick minute. I like that. It's always been precisely one minute. Can't be quicker nor slower. My dear brother, I'm writing this letter to tell you that Susan and I will be leaving the camp. The place has become too dangerous and I fear for Susan's safety. She is lonely because there are no other children her age here. I've heard of a place further into the forest where some people have already settled. It would be perfect to start a new life. I'm thinking of setting up a farm where I can grow our own food and where Susan can play safely. The journey might take longer than expected because of the wolf packs. We have to go through the mountains, although the, the way is longer we can go at our own pace without the risk of wolves. I will write to you as soon as we have settled in. Take care of yourselves and your family. Charles. What do we have? Oh, the blooming Bible is everywhere. Sorry, I didn't mean that. No, sorry, no blasphemy intended. <laughs> it is though. Right, we're not getting through. Yeah. Blocked off door. That's something we will fall back to later. Okay, minecart. Traps. Deliberately sprung. That was clever of her. Deliberately sprung. So what is it? We've got a few options. I know obviously I know we've got the the uh the door we can break with Antea's power. Here though, a junction box and another door. Okay, we've got a little puzzle here. There is a little puzzle. Okay, well, we can grab that, turn it. And blast it through this thing. Aha! <coughs> For what? I don't. I do not know. What's the point of that? Why is that? Why was that even a thing? There's nothing here. There's got to be a reason for that. There's no lever. I think that's that's a deliberate distraction. A very mean one. Not to make you angry. Oh. And now we found an orb to pull. Now what did it turn? Hmm. Well, this one's got me thinking. Can't blast this open. What is going on? Whoa. God, this reminds me of Fallout. Finding a dead skeleton parked in a corner. Now, why would they give us this window? Is there something shootable here? Just feels like this is such a deliberate placement. Can't see anything.
that's locked as well. What is going on? Alright, I'm going downstairs because I, I know there's this lift at the bottom. And I wonder if we can activate it down here. Once we get down, how the hell do we get back up? Ah. Oh, look at that. A minecart and a lift. However, if we took it this way, what would it do for us? Absolutely sweet F.A. Little Madden's men more than gold. I huh. come from the Spanish Americas. All our misery is built on gold. Slaves died in the mines by the thousands so the kings of Europe could fill their coffers. This is why I overcharge. King Charles took it well, as I remember. Then I should have charged a bastard more. Okay, we do have something. Oh, that. oh, I thought I had to bring that mine cart out to get up, get up to this position. I think, though, that was entirely unnecessary. I think the game's toying with us, giving us a few dead ends. What is the deal here? What are you trying to do? Oh, to get up there, we need the minecart from down here. They are playing around with us. This is oh, I say I'd stop short of saying genius. I think it's deliberately designed to confuse you. This little section. Get you in there. Tuck you up in the nice lift. There's a reason for everything, you know? That's one thing, though, I suppose you, can, you sort of see through it. To a point. You know they've put something there for a reason. And here we go. Here is the reason. More crap! they say is that we found a no no special place I have an enormous <laughs> you're wondering what I was going to say there I have an absolutely enormous amount of rubbish but I, I'm building up a store of crap. Oh, look at that. Just when you think you're getting close. Have some of this. Might as well start as we mean to go on. Hit them it's from a distance. It's very rare you get a chance Spectre to do that, you know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's really rare you get a chance. To shoot from a distance like this. Get the hell out of there! All right, all right, I'm out of there. I'm out of there. That one is shielded. Shield, shielded. Oh, he's shielded by that other green ass. Stop that spectre before it possesses the corpse. I think it's too late. This is the one we want. I'm here, damn it. Okay, yeah, 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 got it. You're here. I'm here too. The 
shielded again. Which one is the one doing the shielding? Is that you? you or you at the back? Alright, it is. Take it easy now. You're wasting your time on this one. Why? Where is the thing that's doing the shielding? I thought I was doing pretty well here. Oh, you're talking about the other one that I accidentally hit. Taya, you are disappointing me now. Dong. Oh, I'm coming for you. All too easy, apparently. Whatever's down there, I hope it's worth the trip. Yeah, me too. Footprints. Too deep to miss. They're a little old, but I'm guessing Edith Keen. All right, Miss Keen. What were you up to? Right, all we got out of that was a direction. An old bloodhound here can follow that trail. I wonder if, as I've said before, do, are they collectibles? I, I've checked in the menus and I, I couldn't find like how many of them there are in the game. But that does seem to me the most likely. They don't seem to do anything. If you need a rest, this place is as good as any. Yeah, I think I think I will just just to get a save point. Edith's short note. Daniel, if you ever find this note, know that you're too late. In a few minutes, despite the pouring rain and the raging storm, I'll be digging up the treasure with my sharpened for the occasion shovel. In a few minutes, I'll be soaked but rich, while you'll remain poor and sorry. Who was Daniel? Edith's bag. The bloody great hole in it. But it does tell us she was here. Yeah, but it tells us she was here in the past tense. Lightning will do that. Where's her gear? Maybe it fell. Wait, so we're saying Edith's now dead. Hint obtained. Thought worn down and out of a life of farming, this sharecropper seems kind and generous and always ready with a smile. Having gone into the wilderness alone, Edith was killed by lightning. Oh, Daniel. Oh, Daniel. That's Daniel. So they had a bit of a disagreement because she, her letter was like, ah, you're going to be poor and I'm going to be rich, you bastard. So... Was she really that desperate for the treasure? People would die to be rich, that is very true. Some people would die to be rich. Let's find her tie and ask her. The love of money, as they say. And this, this is one of those quotes that's often mis, misquoted. A lot of people say, 
money is the root of all evil. It's not. That's not the quote. The quote is the, the love of money is the root of all evil. It's quite a big difference in those two statements. It's absolutely true, though. Oh, it looks like we simply have to go downstairs. I thought this was a collectible of some kind. Just a metal pan. Oh, boy. Uh, belongings downstairs. But, I mean, if it's a simple case of her being struck by lightning, what is... what mystery is there to be solved? I mean, we know Daniel is still haunted, though, so... Why would Edith have come back to haunt him? What did he do? Do they? They never learn. Quite oh, good. We got a good, good, good bit. Whoa! Dodge Where did you time. spring up from, fella? Good bit of distance between us there for a moment. Whoa! They hit like a trap, those things. Big boy down. That's what she said. Right here. Yeah, I'm in trouble. I'm glad I took that short rest. I was trying to dodge. Don't know what happened. Reinforcements. Okay, the reinforcements took a little while to turn up. We're good, we're good. Oh, look at you over there. Dodgy bugger. Alright, big boy down. Time to deal with the minions. That should be it. Alright, Edith, where'd you keep your stuff? Here's your stash. This takes us all the way back up. I don't think we need it yet, though. I'm still down here somewhere. God, it's a long way down. Yes, it's a weird one. Seems like not much of a mystery yet. Turn and leave. Wait, what? God, I hate ghosts. Hi. Very annoying. Uh -huh. Very funny. She won't get away. Let's find another path. Alright, we missed her. If, if she was invisible there, I'm sorry. Our camera was not aimed at her at the time. It's towards this sort of later part of the game. They up at, well, I, I suppose I could have come here a lot sooner, so it's not really technically later, but this particular mission has been filled with random things. Alright, these guys have got to be taken out. Hand to hand. I have another in sight. We got this. Getting tougher and tougher. I mean, you'd expect it to, though, wouldn't you? Try another one. Oh, he's protected again. Shift your balance. All right, all right, all right. Okay, getting cornered here. Come on. 
can't get a hit in. Ride it out. Change targets. Torment it first. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm not dying today. Right. Who's next? Oh, their powers combined are brutal. Incoming. All right. I've had just about enough. God for that. Okay, there's more to this. Right, we got another portal door. There's one. I take the heart, you take the roots. Yeah, yeah, I got the plan. I'm just trying to figure out uh, where they are. Right, one there, one on the surface. Lively. Quick and precise. Hey, well done. we got him. That was that was getting close though. God, this is a big old mission. Still not found her bag of stuff. Got more things to fight down this alley if we should ever come to it. But there's oh, there's one of those totems up there. That is free upgrades. That just light up while we were walking towards it. That's a little spooky. Where are you, young lady? Something's concealed. Something is concealed, and it's right here. Dust piece of eight. Are you kidding me? Oh, maybe this is it. This is about as far down as we can get. Something's nearby. Where is it? Right there. Ah, oh, this must be her stuff, no? of a map. A piece of a map found on Edith's body on which is drawn a part of the region with a cross. This tie is doused with the essence of its ghost once a closure has been... Yeah, okay, so this is what's tying the ghost Half back. The map. Here's the rest. Let's ask Edith. Oh. So what is it? She just... She can't rest until she's found the treasure? 
A selfish ghost indeed. He can foolish his hookah. You really are a pain. Now, what do you want? I know you. Of course you do, Miss King. Of course you do. I don't know you. I'm Antea Duarte. If you're Edith King, your brother Daniel worries for you. I'm Miss Edith Keane, and my brother can troop off, as can you. What's your problem with your brother? He, a wicked man, let me die. He let me die. And I would like him to be punished for it. We'll come to that. First, a couple of questions. How did he let you die? I mean, you came here on your own, did you not? Or is that a lie? Why is Daniel to blame? Why is Daniel to blame for your death? You don't know him. You don't know the truth of him. You don't know nothing at all. You were caught in a storm. Daniel threw no thunderbolts. I was in the woods because Daniel is a scheming manipulator who cannot be trusted, not even by his own sister. He has you fooled. He has everyone fooled. He's a liar. He's a schemer. He's a thief. He's a deserter. He'd have taken the treasure and run. I don't know. I mean... Just because she's saying that makes you think, Oh, yes, well, he seemed too good to be true before. That must be the case. Yes, clearly he's a liar. He's deceptive. He's actually not a nice guy as he seems to be. We've got to take her word for it? Only her word for it? So what, you're saying he planned to steal this treasure? He planned to steal it? Oh yes, he did. But I beat him there. I nipped his little scheme in the bud, I did. I lopped his nibs for him. The money is mine. I deserve it. I deserve it all. Every penny and every pot. And what about the full map? We've only got half of it. What did, what did he have the other half or something? Why did you leave with only half a map? I have a memory. I've seen the full map and I remember it all. I knew the way. He thought he was better. Better than me? Ha! The fool. But the fool lives while I am dead. How is that fair? His foolishness killed me. He shall not profit from it. She's annoying me now. They both are. <laughs> yeah, I kind of, I'm kind of on Keen. Antea's side My there. My brother must be punished. I am dead because of him. I don't know. I honestly, I don't know if we can take her word for this. Edith blames Daniel for her fate and wants revenge. So, although she died alone in the wilderness, Edith blames Daniel for her death and wants revenge. Yes. Got it. Daniel. Is there more to his story? Find a way out of the ravine. Oh, good lord. Okay. I will, I will do that. She's full of resentment. Uh, she blames him or she's selfish? I don't know. She definitely blames him. I don't know if we can call her selfish yet. We need to talk with the brother. Yeah. I was kind of hoping, like, as, as has been in some of the cases in these quests, that the brother just sort of turns up and goes, Oh, you're here. Yes, we're here. Let's get out. We saw a lift earlier on. The lift. Elevator. Uh, oh. I just happened upon it. Perhaps. Oh. Maybe not. Oh, maybe I have. Ha ha! It's 
probably more right. to explore and discover down there. The we'll find it. Find it, yeah, thankfully. The game gave us a radar. Wait, 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 wait. Oh. I just saw the barrel hanging. Oh no, it's good. Give me whatever that was. It's gonna be like, I don't know, a couple of pieces of silver. Three, three items of leather, wonderful. Right, camp up here. And then I guess we can fast travel. Oh, did I not let that down? Oh. Annoying little bugger. Die, you bastard. This is where we fought the wolves when we first turned up. Yeah, let's see if we can head up towards whatever camp this is. and let us. Oh, no, maybe there is. Because I don't fancy running all the way back having to fight all the same enemies I've fought on the way here. Hell no. Let's, uh... That's fine. I don't care. Will we, will we return? Who knows? Now we know we're end game. I can be a little bit more um, casual about things. So back to Daniel. This is actually the last mission in this in this section. I can't believe I've managed to actually finish an entire cluster of these. Right. Your oh. Sweet talk will not work here. The Vanisher is not as stupid as he looks. Well, thank you very much. That's a backhanded compliment. What news of my sister? Well, I found her. She stood right next to you. I found her. I found your sister. Has she... has she passed? Yes. Oh, dear Lord. I'm sorry. She's gone. My sister is gone. She haunts you, yes, but what happened between you two? What happened between you? My sister was complicated, sir. A good Puritan, but no stranger to the sin of envy. Envy isn't usually fatal. Huh. Did you have a disagreement? Oh, aye. We've had a few. From when she was a child, Edith dreamed of position. Me? Well, I just wanted good land to till and decent food to eat. Oh, it's just... He seems so... Normal. Nice. And Edith seems to despise him so. <sighs> is, he, if, is he just really good? Really good acting. Her, ha her ghost still haunts you, Daniel. There's something you should know, and you must know it now before more harm is done. Daniel, you're haunted by your sister's ghost. How could it be otherwise? No one bears a grudge like Edith Keane. She blames you for her death. Of course she does. She blames me for everything. She blamed me for our poverty. She blamed me when the crops failed. She blamed me for the map. The map? Of course. Did you find the map? Aye. There was a map. 
I'll be keeping it for now. For the best, no doubt. For the best. I'll need to have a look around your house. Hope you don't mind. Do what you please. I've nothing to hide. You fool. You'll not last long without me. What is going on? Okay. Need a look around your house. Ringing. Like a home. Whoa. Still here. No, I need more evidence. What is this? An annotated map of New Eden's dark woods regions. It's been That's digging it. up gold and digging up worms. I know which I'd choose. Neither seems to have made them rich. Let's see. Cross the bridge, go through the forest, turn east, and... Good. I've got everything I need. Caught red-handed! You thief! How dare you steal from your own sister! I... I, I just wanted to look at it again. Here, take it back. I bloody well will. I've got to be honest, he did not to go hunting for treasure alone. He did. Uh, he kept it a secret. Why? Because she's such a pain in the ass, probably. He kept it a secret. She found out. There's more to this. Yeah, there is. But is it because she's just such so annoying? He didn't want to be around her. How about a chance to reveal the past? Okay, I'm in. Uh, does it make manifest? No, what's the, what's the chant one? Reveal an echo. Yes, that one. Reunius fat aster himi. Fat ass. The camp is doomed like the rest of New Eden. We go! The risk is too great! We claim the treasure and leave directly. You're as foolish as our father and you're going... Don't! No. You're as headstrong as was our adult mother. She was stern, but she was fair. Half for you, half for me. God grant me patience. I don't know. She's still not Let's winning me over. Daniel wouldn't agree to her plan, or how did she think that would work? Did she think she'd find the treasure? Seems unlikely. There's more to this. Intent obtained. Really? We seem to have all the pieces now. After splitting their treasure map to pre uh, prevent betrayal, Daniel tried to double-cross Edith and claim the treasure for himself. Tried to memorize her piece, but got caught. I see. So, all right. That does begin to make a little more sense now. Fortune, I'm writing to, to you to get a refund for my order placed for my tools. No sooner had they been used than they broke. I do not doubt your competence, and I'm aware of the difficulties, especially at the moment. But things are difficult for us, too. So if you don't want me to... Uh, if you don't want the rest of the colony to learn of this misadventure, please reimburse me for the cost and cut. So Edith used Fortune, who we've met before, to make all those tools that snapped in half. I wonder if they were sabotaged. The soil, the land, and the fields. I don't think that... They came prepared. Not prepared enough, it seems. Yeah, I don't think that one was important. Daniel, I received your letter and did as you said. Apparently, old Callaghan's land is for sale, so you should be interested. His son doesn't want to take over his farm. He's gone to town. I warned you that it wouldn't be easy in New England, but you were stubborn enough to leave everything behind. All that's left is to convince your sister to come back too, because you know you won't be able to afford to buy the old man's land on your own. Anyway, I'm waiting to hear from you to know what to do. Your friend, Joe. I don't think that helped us, really. Alright, I don't know what to decide here. I'm in... I'm in two minds. So, is it done? I know all I need to know. So you can help me? Let's speak frankly, shall we? 
Having caught you trying to steal her part of the map, your sister fled alone into the woods. I weren't stealing it, I was just looking at it. Is it my fault she ran off into the forest? I think it might be, friend, yes. I don't know, I... I mean... I don't like either of them now. You don't feel a little bit guilty? You don't feel guilty? No. Her greed killed her, not me. You don't know her. She'd have gone no matter what I'd done. I almost believe that. <sighs> I'll help you. How will I help? I said I'd help you and I keep my word. You must face your sister one last time. Edith, show yourself. Dead because of you! Banish her! Now, man, do it before she does something terrible! End your mewling, you bag of shite! The Banisher knows that this is all your fault! No, not mine. Your misadventure was your own. All right, that's enough. If you can stop bickering for just a minute, perhaps we can get to the truth. With that, we may even have an ending. Wow. Edith, your, your death was your fault. Or Daniel, you double-crossed her. Edith, you wanted prosperity here. I mean, this is obvious. Let's, let's explore that anyway. Edith, you were determined to make the farm prosperous. Am I right? A fool's errand. The land is cursed. I knew I'd never be a queen. I'd like as never be a mother. But I would make a garden grow. And in it... I could content, grow old. We are the salt of the earth, sir. The, the saltier sister has lost its savour. <laughs> Daniel wanted to go home. Okay, I don't think I want to explore those. I, I kind of got the measure of them both already. Daniel, you double-crossed her, or you tried to, got caught. But Edith, the death was your fault. I don't know. Do I have to pick one? Only one? I don't think you can say the death was her fault simply because she wanted to preempt what she thought her brother was going to do anyway. She's not a very nice person, but again, I don't really like either of them now. Daniel, you double-crossed her. Edith went treasure hunting alone, aye. But only because she knew you, Daniel, would double-cross her. She was right. You tried to steal the map, you antiquated rogue! I didn't try to steal the map, you horrible old drudge. I just wanted to look at it. It was you who sneaked off after the treasure alone. You left me no choice, you meal-mouthed excuse for a man. And now I am dead. Oh, right. That's enough. I've had enough of these two. Let's get it over with. Well, what do we do? Uh, oh, I've got to... I can't get it over with. Edith, your death was your fault. I, but, wait a minute. Alright, I've got to go down Edith, that one. You went after the treasure alone. You had a wee accident. You can't hang on Daniel here. That's right. Without your scheming, I'd not have braved the woods alone. Without your scheming, I'd yet be alive. You killed me! You killed yourself, you stupid cow! <laughs> Alright, I'm going to bring this to an end. All right, we know enough. Let's end this. I'm not sure I can really make a decent decision here. Edith Keane, do we banish her? Why? Because what? What did she do? She was... She was the one who aggressively tore the map in half and was like, Oh, you have half eye half. They don't get on. They were always bickering. And the, the, anything they did was never a, a pleasant shared experience not very nice people either of them we can get her to ascend just get her to disappear disappear from this world leave daniel alone or we can blame daniel now the one this i mean i don't really get do you know what this is the first time in all of these missions where i've, I've felt nothing either way 
So I'm going to take option four, <laughs> which in my own cruel way, I'm going to let them spend the rest of eternity arguing with each other. Daniel Keane, your greed and manipulation drove your sister to her death. And what's it to you anyway? Oh, Danny, he's a gonna make you pay. He's a gonna make you pay big. You what? sound like Jar Jar Binks. No, not I. You are what is holding Edith to this world. Without you, there is no haunting. Without you, everyone will be safe. Yeah, not one of my proudest moments, this one, but in all honesty, I didn't really feel like doing any of the things they gave me the choice to do, so I... We'll take the option of getting Antea back into the living world. I don't I think that's going to happen, though. To have known a moment as a rich man before I go. Well, small fortunes. That haunting case is done. What people do for money, honestly. I, I, I know it's easy when you've got money to say it's not important. Of course, I'm not saying I've got money. I've got enough to get by. But when it does that to people, when it, when it makes them hate their own blood, and you know there's something wrong. Be happy with what you've got is the secret, I think, to happiness in life. Stick with that and we'll all be... We'll all be alright. Guys, thanks for watching this one. Pretty impressive uh, story, but... Uh, very difficult choice in the end, but not for the same reason as some of the other difficulties. This one was just because I couldn't think of what else to do. Take care, I'll see you in the next one, all the best, and good night.